Oh, oh, this is. I have I have question marks for eyes. I don't remember this being so creepy. I don't remember this being so creepy. Happy home designer, what are you doing? So today we're raising money for Extra Life. You weren't aware. We're raising money for Extra Life, which is uh, gives money to the Children's Miracle Network of Hospitals. And um, we have a goal of $200 with also a stretch goal of $300. We're $37 in and we just started, so yay. Um, and yes, I often play Animal Crossing. I have put... Over 3,500 hours, I'm working on 4,000 hours of New Leaf, um, but, and we're just starting a brand new save of Happy Home Designer today, uh, which I'm really looking forward to because I love Happy Home Designer, so. I have played it a lot, um, but we're starting over. We're starting over. Got a new copy because they're insanely cheap now, so, um, so that's what we're going to do now. But yes, if you ever, if you... I have a I have a sticker or three on my face. I have three three stickers. Yes. Um so there is a list of incentives um down below in the panel. And also if you click the if you click through the donate or extra life links, um you can also choose what incentive you want to donate towards. Um, there's a bunch of there's a bunch of them. Thank you for the extra life command. Hi DMC. Um, oh, so speaking of stickers, claim your stickers and have Fuchsia send them to me. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so we have a whole bunch of a whole bunch of uh, fun donations that you can donate towards, and all the money goes to benefit children in hospitals who are very sick. Um, so every a dollar will be uh, a sticker on my face. Um, Five dollars bean boozled beans, uh, which I always I always subject myself to always. Um, Ten dollars will get a cat chain. Fifteen dollars a cat camera, which actually I owe a cat camera. Fifteen minutes of the cat camera to Mogan because she actually managed to get her donation through earlier when Extra Life was down. Um, and uh, then like $20 I'll do a three minute MS Paint drawing of any Animal Crossing character from memory. Uh, $25 you can affect gameplay like you can decide what you want me to put in the house. We'll be playing Minecraft later also so you can decide like what you want me to do in Minecraft. Um, and then $50 I'll do... Um, $50 will be an MS Paint drawing of anything of your choice. You know, what's in reason. But, yes. So that's, and then our goals are $50. We'll do a community game night, either Splatoon or Jackbox. Probably Jackbox, honestly. We haven't done Jackbox. Um, $100 will be a modded Minecraft stream, and the community can choose the mod that you want me to play. Um, or mod pack. Um, two hundred dollars I'll do in Animal Crossing New Leaf cosplay. And then three hundred dollars, which is our stretch goal, I'll do a hardcore Minecraft stream. See how far I can get in hardcore mode, or alternatively, how many times I have to restart over. Um, so. So, uh, those are, those are the, um, goals and the incentives. Can donate to all of those and our alerts are working now so now I'll actually know when you when you donate imagine imagine okay come over here with me to the 3ds and we'll play some happy home designer I'll make a special tip for you to use one of my stickers and put it on your face nah, maybe so if you haven't played Happy Home Designer before, Happy Home Designer is 
a side game in the Animal Crossing uh, universe and uh, you just decorate homes for villagers. When you first get their request, they have um, a specific request and um, and then you can like expand their houses and make really cool rooms. He he needs to claim his stickers so that you can have them though. So here we go. Here we go with a uh, start. Today is the day our new employee arrives. Yes, yes. The new addition should be here at any moment, so I shall use this time to double check the hiring forms. Yeah, yeah. AZ makes a very good point. Mikey, I know you really you really hate this game and didn't want to be here and um and did not want me to play Happy Home Designer at all. But we really appreciate you being here to support my stream and the kids for the kids you're doing this for the kids <laughs> now where have those hiring forms gotten themselves off to i'm certain they were right here pardon me lottie perhaps you know do you remember the new hire's name no it was um so in the mod chat in the mod chat <laughs> In the mod chat, I was like, I was like, so I was thinking about starting a new Happy Home Designer save and streaming that. And Mikey was like, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> and we were like, so maybe? <laughs> you don't remember? Please, Mr. Nook, try to keep it together. If I recall correctly, the name was... What's my name? Okay, so my other, my actual character for, wait, hold on, is my actual is my character named Fuchsia in the other one? Hold on, I need to check. If my character's named Fuchsia in the other one, then I need to change, I need to do something else. But, um, if not, then we can, then we can still name it. Oh, my 3DS is frozen. It's fr I don't... That's what I'm thinking. I think it might be Lynn. But we'll we'll have to check. I'll have to check after my 3DS unfreezes. See, the thing is, I was using... Um, I was using NTR. Um, and then I put it into sleep mode, forgetting that... Um, that matters. Let me, actually, can I show you? Uh, give, me, give it a second. Hello? Oh. Let's start. I have to hit connect. Connect. There we go. Okay. That's why it's that's why it's not. Okay. Hi Luna, how are you? Okay. Look! It's not the smoothest. It's NTR. So it's not the smoothest, but but we, uh, we can actually see my other 3DS now. Just came back from a con today? What con did you go to? See, I think it might be Lynn, but I need to make sure. I think- oh. Whoops. I'm in the middle of a house. We're all done. We're all done. I don't know if I changed anything, but 
Um, also, I'm used to like watching on my screen, and there is definitely like a significant delay, and I can't do that. <laughs> we don't need to watch this. We don't need to watch this. Can you just tell me my name? Say my name, say my name. Okay. I think it's Lynn. But I just need to make sure. I didn't finish. Look at that. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Draga. Oh, sure. Just call me Tiger. That's fine. That's not answering any of my questions. Um. Can I... If you talk to me, will you tell me my name? Um, can you tell me my name? There's like no TPC. So, I have no idea how I'm supposed to do this. Where's my name? Where's my name? I mean, this is Mayor Lynn, so it should be, it should be Mayor Lynn. But, please don't say my name. We might be unhappy home designer for more than an hour. Maybe. Okay, Colton, please. We don't... Okay, you know what? You know what? We will go to Lolly. Lolly will not disappoint us, okay? Okay? We're going to Lolly. If you start a new day... Probably. We're learning things about Happy Home Designer, okay? Hello there! Lolly. Okay. Okay. I... Lolly disappointed me. <laughs> Hello there! It's like... It's like... How I greet people when I can't remember their names. <laughs> Lolly. <laughs> Please. <laughs> okay. We're starting a new day. We're starting a new day. <laughs> hey, you. No, no, like, I, I don't make it obvious that I don't know their name. I'm just like, hello there. I'm pretty sure it should be Mayor Lynn. We're gonna get through all of this and it's gonna be Mayor Lynn. And I'm like, okay, cool. We won't have to. Yes. Um. Hi, Jenny. It is Fuchsia. It is Fuchsia. Should we make Mayor Lin? I mean, this is basically Mayor Lin, though. This is Mayor Lin. Like. Anyway, that solves that. That solves that question. Okay. Okay. Well, that solves that question. Good thing I checked. Good thing I checked. We'll make, we'll make Mayor Lin. She's like... I think Happy Home Designer was about the time that I started using my name. Because I didn't use Fuchsia, like, for a while. Um, like, I didn't use, like, that's why we had Shiny Bee for so long, because I didn't use Fuchsia. And that actually lines up time-wise. So, so that would be why. Um, okay. But then... Should we should we go with Lynn or should we just do Foosh? Chad decide. Because Lynn was kind of my um like my Animal Crossing persona for a really, really, really long time. We can pull it. If I knew how to make a poll. If I knew how to make a poll. Okay, you want to learn how to make a poll on Twitter? There's Twitter has a new poll function. There's a poll. 
Polls! Create a new poll. Okay. Okay. Name. We're gonna do either Foosh or Lin. Um, Tom Crook. I'm not making my name Tom Crook. Okay. We'll do a two minute poll. You can only do, it's up to three minutes. Look, there's a, there's a poll. Look at that. Look at that. Voted. Okay, cool. We're testing out this new, this new poll function. Um, it's at, it's at the top. Oh, are you on mobile? If you're on mobile, um, it shows up differently. It, it works on mobile, but you have to, like, do, like, extension mark vote one or two. Option one is fuchsia, and uh, option one is fuchsia, and option two is lin. I believe that's how it works. Hi, Khaleesi, how are you? And hi, Rock Boys. Welcome back. Um, but yeah, you can do, you can do, there's no Fushi, no. I don't go by Fushi, I go by Fush. I'm very particular about nicknames in general, and I hated nicknames for most of my life, and the fact that I let people call me Fush is a, is, is a big thing, <laughs> so. <laughs> um, and it looks like it's going to be Fush. It's three to zero. Unless every four to zero, four to zero, it's okay. It's okay. I just that's just something that you call me and nobody else does, so it's fine. But. You've been trying to get Animal Crossing happy. Okay, we're naming naming our character Foosh. Um, it's it's a fun game. You can get it for really cheap now, um, from Amazon or Five Below has it also. Okay, the new hire's name is Foosh. Right. Honestly, Mr. Nook, you really need to keep better track of these things. Oh ho, I certainly blanked out on that name for a moment. It's such a nice name, too. A rare moment of forgetfulness for me. I'm sure it won't happen again. Now, from what I recall, this new employee happens to be... It's 4 a.m. Okay. Thank you for your lurk. Um, we're a girl. Also, actually, I hear Jenny. I hear Jenny. Um, we need to do cat cam. That looks really bad. Um... Let me configure that. The white balance is very off, that's why. I will do that. There we go. Okay, so one of the donations was for five minutes of the cat cam. So there you go. Um, the white balance was very, very off. So, uh, fix that. Fix that. There we go. So that's Ginny. Um, avocado is also up here. We could also do cat cam of avocado. Oops. But it's set up for Ginny right now. Um, you saw a Happy Home Designer at $14.99 at GameStop. It's, GameStop's not the cheapest place to get it. You can get it for $5 at Five Below if you have a Five Below by you. Or you can, um, you can get it for, I got it for $10 on, on, a on, a Amazon. Actually, I'm gonna change, I'm gonna change the cat camera. No, I'm not. Oh, Felix just walked away. Felix came over, looked at me, and walked away. Am I certain she's a girl? 
Yes. Yes, she is a girl, of course. Now, if only I could remember what she looks like. Oh, character creation. It's because Jenny is blue because she has because I have the blue lights. So that's why I was trying to I was trying to fix it a little. Um I have the blue lights on the background. So that's that's why. Like I can fix the color the white balance a little, but, but yeah. But that's why. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, this is I have I have question marks for eyes. I don't remember this being so creepy. I don't remember this being so creepy. Happy home designer, what are you doing? Thank you for the five bits, lovely. No, no, it's because I have the blue background lights. Okay, so I have blue eyes. And... Like, I don't... I don't have very big eyes. But I want to pretend I do. These are the cutest eyes. I love these eyes. Maybe just this. How much did I? <laughs> uh, I'm also very pale. There's a girl at work that's gonna tell me... Um... That's gonna sh teach me how to do makeup, and she's like, "I don't have foundation to match your skin. We have to go shopping. You're too pale." <laughs> like, thanks. Hi, Ronnie. How are you? Oh, hairstyle. Um, do we have? Why can't I? Oh, there we go. That's how I rotate. There's no uh. There's no beehive. There's no beehive. How do they expect me to make myself? Like this is the closest this is the closest thing. Yeah. Uh, dying dying Felix would do nothing. It would be a thousand dollars to die Felix. How about that? Okay, what's my what's my actual hair? Kind of like that, but kind of not. I don't have bangs. That's the thing. Like, Animal Crossing characters always have bangs. And... I guess because I have the side part kind of thing. Uh, yeah, Amazon has it for eleven seventy five. That sounds pretty good. This looks nothing like me. At all. But... This whole time you've made over one whole house while I figured out what my name was and made my character? Uh, sure. We'll do this. You good? It's nice to see you, Ronnie. One kit you had a came with a DVD showing how to die. Just sit back and watch your kids die. <laughs> it takes me so long to do houses. I wonder how cheap you could get New Leaf. New Leaf is not super cheap like Happy Home Designer. Oh, there goes Felix. Um, like Happy Home Designer and Meepo Festival. It's like 20, probably. Maybe 15. You might be able to find it for 15. But if you want to buy it news, it's, it's it's 20. That wasn't Felix, right? That was just a shadow gremlin. Everyone, this is Foosh. Starting today, she will be working with us here at Nook's Homes. Perhaps it should give you a quick introduction to each of your new colleagues, huh? This fellow here is Lyle. Bang! Nice to meet you, Foosh. Lyle is something of a veteran in the office. He's been here almost as long as I have. Wait, do I still have it? Hold on. Am I still- I'm not still sub to Dazza. Dazza has a bang- a Lyle bang emote. Um. In fact, he's so good at what he does, even I don't quite understand what he's doing most of the time. Ha, huh, I'm kidding. Of course I know how everything works. Sure you do, Tom. You gonna get it? Yay! Um, ha, huh, I'm kidding. Of course I know how everything works. Now then, next is our dog about town, Digby. Uh, yeah, like, I normally sub to Daza, but I, I, um, 
stopped almost all of my subs for the month because I'm going to New Zealand. So I stopped almost all of my subs just uh, to uh, save a little bit of money because I usually spend way too much on subs. So right now I'm just like, I'm only keeping my active subs to Misha, Frank, and uh, and uh, Blue. Actually, actually, hold on. Actually, I think I have my Twitch Prime. I think I have my Twitch Prime available. Hated this man for a long time, really? Oh no. November 9th is when I get my Twitch Prime. Um, yeah, I mean, he was, he was kind of skeezy in Wild World, his first game. Nice to meet you. My name's Digby. Oh, look at, look at Lottie. It's a real pleasure to have you working here with us, Boosh. Hope we'll get a chance to work together on a project really soon. Look how often they say our name in this one. When we were first starting. <laughs> there goes Jenny. It's actually, it's actually, uh... It's actually been five minutes. Yay! Um... Unsub to yourself and have Amazon send you 25. <laughs> if only, right? No, I wouldn't do it because because I love my emotes. Digby is certainly one of our most enthusiastic employees, as you may have gathered. Yes, Lottie has a crush on, on Digby. Yes. Finally, let me introduce Lottie. Ahem? Lottie? Yes? Oh, hi there. Lottie is an exceptional employee and a consummate professional. She's also an expert in home design. Lottie will be handling your training as well, so pay attention and follow her advice. As you all know, I'm a very busy raccoon, so that wraps up today's meeting. Lottie, she's all yours. Goodbye, my obedient employees. Busy, busy, oh so busy. Okay. So. Tutorial! Who's ready for a tutorial? That boss of ours, he likes to complain about his busy schedule, even though we all know he's just rushing off to make his tea time. Huh. Hey, that's still his schedule. But, you know, maybe not work. Well, enough about golf. Let's get you settled in. We're all so glad you come join the company, Foosh. I'm sure you can't wait to hear about the work you'll be doing at Nook's home, so let's get to it. Start. I want to. I want you to do a simple interior remodel on a client's home. You'll pick out new wallpaper, a new carpet, some new furniture. Basically, you're going to give the room a complete makeover. There's a practice room all ready for you. I'll come along and teach you the basics. But before we get started, you should take this. There's a changing room upstairs, so head on up and change into your official uniform, Boosh. I'll be waiting right here. Come and get me when you're ready. So we unlock a lot of stuff um, with play coins after, like, we can, we'll be able to scan in QR codes, we'll be able to change our hair and everything, um, but right now, we just change into our uniform. There we go! Okay. Perfect fit. Was there an option of it not fitting? Everyone's the same size. Maybe which I mean all the Animal Crossing, like, humans. Mr. Nook likes to see his employees wear the company uniform, so make sure you wear it tomorrow, too. That's kind of what a uniform is. Of course, you can accessorize your uniform however you like. Use the changing room for that. Are you ready to learn all about interior design? Great, let's go. Let's go. All right, your training is officially underway. By the way, this is a real home you're working on, so take good care of the place. The client who lives here is a girl who is a fan of all things cute, just like me. She's requested a room with a lovely atmosphere. 
So let's turn this empty space into something lovely, shall we? Turning it, we're turning this house into lovely. First, let's see what's inside that cardboard box over there. To open it, just tap the rectangular block on the touch screen. <laughs> Good job. That lovely love seat is actually one of the client's most prized possessions. You'll find clients often have pieces they're very attached to. They love it when you incorporate their pieces into your design, so be sure to do so. They don't give you an option not to do so. Of course, you can't just plop furniture down in any old way and expect that to work. Actually, you can. Actually, you can, but shh. So let me explain how to change a piece of furniture's orientation. To, th to do that, you tap the block on the touch screen, just like you did before. Go ahead and give it a try. There we go. Great, you're a fast learner. I like that. Or I've done this before. N next up, let's talk about how to move things. It's a cinch. Just drag the block on the touch screen to wherever you want to place it. Time for your first big decision. Where do you want to put that lovely love seat? I want to put it right here. Just like that. Now you know how to place and orient furniture like a pro. Also, okay, so... Which you are, of course. So, my earbuds... I know I don't normally, like, use my earbuds on stream. But I lost, like, one of the small... One of the small uh, rubber parts on it. And so I have, like, one of the medium-sized one. And my ears are too small and it keeps falling out. That's why I keep... That's why, like, every three seconds I'm like, let me... Let me touch my ear. It's very annoying. <laughs> I couldn't find the other ones. I know I have others, but I couldn't find them. Uh, why do I have such a small head? Nobody knows. <laughs> this room is going to need more than a single love seat before we can call it done. Tap the leaf on the touch screen to open the furniture catalog and select more items. Find a piece of furniture you like, tap it to select it, and then put it someplace. Easy peasy. Okay. What do we have? Wow, we have such a selection. We have such a selection. Oh, we have a computer. Cool. Um, what do we have over here? <gasps> we have plants. A pothos. I don't want to put it there. There you go. And that's how you choose furniture to suit your client's taste, but not that. Not right there. The furniture isn't the only tool in the home designer's toolkit. Wall decorations are also important. Slur your options with the painting icon and pick out something snazzy. Pothos, of course it's pothos. Okay, so... <gasps> sunflower. We got the sunflower painting already. Hell yeah! A bold choice. I like it. It's amazing for me to see how different designers have such different senses of style. Oh, I almost forgot about wallpaper and flooring. Those are two crucial elements of home design. Open the wallpaper and flooring catalog using the house icon and choose something you like. Once you make your choice, press B or tap the back button on the top right of the screen to close the catalog. Okay. So. Um. I like this, but I like it so much. Maybe we'll do this. This isn't so much. I want this, like, I want this in different colors. Like, I want to be able to, like, refurbish... Can we refurbish wallpaper in New Horizons? Can we refurbish wallpaper in New Horizons, please? There are so many wallpapers that I like, but I don't like the colors. Can we do it? Can we do it? Please? 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 <laughs> Color wheel win? <laughs> right? Okay. Uh. And this one's just like way too bright. So I think we'll do this one. And the neutral floor. I like the neutral floor. Look at that. Do you see how you can change the room's atmosphere by changing the walls and floors? Now let's place a rug to complete the room's design. It's like the cherry on top of a sundae. Tap the rug icon to open the rug catalog and pick out a rug that's the right size and style for your vision. Okay. that right? That's not the right size or... Oh. You're a natural at home design. Amazing. Can I... 
round out the training money and go ahead and place any furniture you like. Or can we move the furniture, please? Feel free to take another look at the client's request whenever you want by tatching, tapping the clipboard on the touch screen. Also, if you ever want to get rid of the furniture you've already placed, just drag the item to the trash can. Oh, there's one more thing. You can use the D-pad to change your point of view and look around the room. Sure, you'll get some new ideas when you change your perspective, so try different angles. Alright, Foosh, you can go about designing this room however you like. I'll play the part of the client here, so come and talk to me when you think you're done. Okay, I'll be waiting. I mean, this is kind of cool. Okay. Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, we have a drafting table. That's it. What else do we have? Oh, we have we have some chagroids. Lovely, we're getting to it. Um see like I like the lovely furniture, but I like it when it has the white. Also, I wanna get rid of that because I want it in the bigger one. There we go. That's one plant too many. What's wrong with you? Who hurt you? See, the thing is, like, I just, I want to refurbish it all. I want to, I want to be able to refurbish it. I heard me. No, we can't refurbish yet. We have to unlock it. Yeah, see, like, this is a refurbishable item. We have to unlock it. But we can do that, we can do that really soon. So, like, don't worry. Back to the chairs. We'll do this, I suppose. Nope. Yeah, a lot of the stuff is unlockable, but like it's really early unlocks. Like really early unlocks. So, it's okay. Actually, I want Maybe like that. Mm. Yeah, it's also been like ages since I did like the beginning of the game, you know. Um. Plants, more plants. All the plants. Maybe we'll put. Oh, that looks really nice there. Because we don't actually have anything to go on the table yet. Oh yes, so if you check out my new my YouTube channel, um, I have a new video up. It's the Dream Time is in a Camelot. It went live earlier today, so so check out check out Camelot. The town since 2013. I've been working on for six years, and I finally finished it, and I'm very proud of it. Um, this looks like a very nice house. Also, Mikey, um, edited it. She didn't make the content, she edited it, but she did a great job. Um, and she's doing a great job editing my videos, and I'm really excited. We ha we'll have, we'll have a new Minecraft video this week. Can you imagine? A new Minecraft video, how long has it been? Because Mikey did a great job editing, so thank you. Um, this is a pretty nice house. What do we think? I mean, we can't do much. We don't have a whole lot of, we don't have a whole lot of, uh, stuff to do. We don't even have, we don't even have ceiling items yet. We don't have ceiling items. Okay. So, there we go. Tutorial over. Um, 
Mikey, I know, I know you, you reminded me to uh, pay you, and then I was like, yep, and then I was struggling with extra life stuff all day. So remind me again tonight. So. <laughs> it seems like you've done a fairly decent job. Fairly decent. I think, I think I did a pretty good job. I think I did a pretty good job, considering I had like ten items to choose from. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Are we ready? Are we ready for the stupid music? This is different music. Never mind. An utterly charming room. This is different music. This is different music! It's not different based on the car. Everyone had the same music. It's not. It's not. No, that's not. Everyone had the same music. Everyone complained about the same music. Um, look at this place. I can't believe I get to live in such a lovely room. Oh, it's for Lottie. I knew that. For some reason, I thought it was for Goldie. But Goldie's the first villager we decorate for. But it's for Lottie. Thank you so much. Oh, did I forget to mention that this is actually my house? I just bought the place, but work has kept me so busy that I haven't had time to decorate. To, the, to tell you the truth, I've been cuddling up in a sleeping bag on the bare floor. Ridiculous. Right. But it looks like a little help from a promising new designer was just what I needed. I'll be sure to let the bots know you passed your training with flying colors. Um, there is outside also. We just, um... We have to do a couple tutorials before we do the outsides. Now then, I think it's time we head back to the office. Let's go. So. Be honest. Yeah, you can decorate the outside of the house? Yep, you can decorate entire yards. Which is why, like, we're... We are like really excited for Happy Home Designer when we saw that because um we've been wanting to decorate yards for ages and now we'll be able to do it in New Horizons. Did you love your first day on the job? You did really well, so I bet you loved it. But you can be upfront with me if you didn't love the job. What I want to know is, can you handle it? Um, it's like the best part of Animal Crossing without the boring chores. I like the boring chores, but yes, it's the best part of Animal Crossing. That's why it's the best. It's the it's it's great. I love it. Um, honestly, it's not my thing. Yes, I hate decorating. I hate decorating houses. What happens if I say honestly? It's not my favorite thing. It's not my thing. I was born to do this. Just as I thought. You really are the right person for the job. I'm glad to hear you think so too. As a matter of fact, I was really impressed with the room you decorated for me today. We guarantee satisfaction here at Nick's Homes, so I had to make sure you were up to snuff. Yeah, this is not supposed to suspend. In a perfect world, I'd have a few more months to train you properly, but I can't hold you back. Thank you for the 345 bits, lovely. That could be three forty-five going to the children, you know. It could be three dollars and forty-five cents going to the children. But thank you. We have a client scheduled to come in tomorrow morning to talk about an interior remodel request. I'm gonna let you take that on as your first real customer job. You've got a big day tomorrow, so you can head home. But you have to write a daily report first. Let me show you to your desk. It's right over here. Your desk and chair are back here on the left, so take a seat and write your daily report. You need to write up a report every day when you're finished with your work. Little details like this that keep Nook's homes running like a well-oiled machine. Jug jug! 
Thanks for all your hard work today, Tiger. Keep it up. What's a daily report? Sit down at your desk to write up your daily report and save that day's work, like she just told us. Business hours are over, but you can keep playing. Er, working. After saving, select continue to move on to the next day's work, or select quit to stop playing. So yeah, we can we can go. Well, we can't. We can't because we're still in the tutor tutorial. But normally, when we finish decorating a house, we come back here. But we can go back out after. Hold up there, Tiger. If you finish your work for the night, you've got to sit down at your desk and write your daily report. Then, what do you have to say? Congratulations on completing your training. Whoosh. Did I correctly overhear what Lottie was saying? You officially start work tomorrow? It's quite an accomplishment. I wish you luck. Yay! We finished day one. 